so welcome to another Java program tutorial and in this tutorial I'm just going to be quickly showing you how to use comments and what a comment is well it's pretty much the most useful thing in Java and what it allows you to do is basically describe what each piece of code is doing so we could say this code is outputting a random directory this code is telling us that it's done and what's good about this is if you're looking for something in a hurry you can find it quite easily without having to actually read the code and figure out what that code is doing because sometimes when you've got like 50 classes or something in a massive project it's going to be pretty hard to figure out what everything does especially if you didn't originally create it especially if you're working with a team of people that have done it with you so that would be pretty hard so although this is just basic code one of them is just from the previous tutorial and the other is just some of the random code I typed. Um, this is just basically to show you how it's used. So to write a comment, what we do is just put two back, two forward slashes, and then just write the comment. So this code outputs a random uh, directory in console, like that. And then down here. We do the same thing like this code tells the oh, tells the user that the program is complete. Just like that. And basically imagine that we had like um Well, basically, imagine that we had like a massive program. We have tons of lines of strings. Obviously, these would all be different things. You can just see how much easier this would be to navigate if you had it commented. And as I said, obviously, this is just the same thing. It's pretty useless. But if these were different things, different comments, that would be very useful. And also, you can just do Control and F. So Control and F, and um. Out, output, or you could type in like directory. You could type in like keywords to find the code that you're looking for. So if there's a spe specific thing that you want to modify, and you've got a massive project, then it's easier just to to control an F and find it. So thank you for watching this tutorial. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next tutorial.